Welcome to the ultimate showdown between GSAP and Animate.js. Today we'll break down what these JavaScript animation libraries do. We'll compare them and help you pick the best one for your project. Let's dive in. First up, we have GSAP or Green Sock Animation Platform. It's a robust, high-performance library trusted by the pros for complex animations. GSAP shines with its timeline control, precise sequencing, and extensive plugin ecosystem like Scroll Trigger and the Morph SVG. It's around 23 kilobytes, doesn't support tree shaking, and offers a free core version. But some plugins require a paid license for commercial use. It's perfect for large-scale professional projects needing cross-browser reliability. Next, we have AnimeJS. This lightweight library, just 6.2 kilobytes, minified, is a open source and beginner friendly. It offers simple, flexible API for animating CSS, SVG, DOM attributes, and JavaScript objects. With timeline control and easing functions, it's great for quick, creative animations. However, it has fewer features than GSAP and less active maintenance, which could be a concern for long-term projects. So, how do they stack up? Well, GHouse is the powerhouse ideal for complex, timeline-driven animations and big projects. It's faster, more feature-rich, and has better community support, but it's heavier and may cost for advanced plugins, while AnimeJS is lean, free, and easier to learn, making it great for smaller projects or rapid prototyping, but it lacks GSAP's depth and may have performance issues with heavy animations. Choose GSAP for professional, intricate animations where performance and control matter most, or go with Anime.js for lightweight, creative projects on a budget. Both are awesome, pick based on your project needs, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you like this video, and happy animating!